we doing, everyone? And welcome to another unboxing of the Big Mega Buddy Pup Ginger. Oh, we are back. Yet again with a Z Box. This time, not as late as the last one, thank God. April Z Box from Zavi. Zavi. No idea what's going to be inside. Other than a t shirt, we know for a fact. These always contain a t-shirt. If you've never seen a Z-Box unboxing or never had one, basically four to seven items in the box. Typically £20 a month unless you buy an advanced package for three, six or 12 months, I believe it is. I have the 12, which brings the total monthly price to 16.99, I believe. As I say, four to seven items. Typically they say at least £35 in value. These days, when it comes to mystery boxes and subscriptions, we kind of just hope we get at least get the money we paid back. But you do get free delivery as well. So far, they've been value for money, even if they have been hella late. So without further ado, -do -do, let's slice and dicey this one. Let's just skim up a bit. And she wants goods are inside. So yeah, the only thing we know that's guaranteed in these boxes <clears throat> is a t-shirt. Everything else is always going to be a little bit of a mystery. So, slice and dice. Oh, get that last bit. I'm going to move forward a smidge so you can get a better look at things. <coughs> Try not to look into the box. Packaging. Right, one. Just seeing how many items we've got. Two. Well, seems like we're going to get yet another puzzle. Uh, three. Four. Yep, seems like they've not decided to pump up these boxes to be uh, make up for all the crap we've gone through in the past. Right, let's see what this box was like for the month. First item is... Something that I've pulled out of HMV cheap ass boxes. A pack of four Game of Thrones... Fridge magnets. That does not make up the box so far. They're, they're cheap. Like what? I don't know. That's not a good first item for me at least. Next item out. Uh, I could feel it was a puzzle. Okay. So next item out. Was the clear. Uh, Green Lantern. Now I do have almost all of these, so that's not Zavi's fault, but they This seems to be the theme. So just for anyone that's got these boxes or is getting these boxes probably for the next few months Just based on the fact that ever since January we seem to have a puzzle in every box. It's pretty much Expect to receive the 3d puzzles from until there's none left I'm hoping that means I'm gonna we're gonna get the see-through Batman because that one's hella hard to get we shall see. <clears throat> Next up is Outpost 31. Next up is a medallion from The Thing. Uh, yeah, okay. Not really that fussed. I mean, that one's not anything special. Zavi probably tries to charge about 20, 30 quid for these, no doubt. It's made from a zinc alloy, so it's worth all about five pounds. And finally, the t-shirts. Let's see if they can at least redeem. Hey, wouldn't you know it? Batman again. Batman seems to be the theme of their t-shirts for the start this year. This one's from Batman Begins, specifically inspired. Actually, that one I kind of like. That I kind of like. Give you a little look see uh, can i get can i get it closer there we go that's probably the best look that's not not bad and certainly it certainly looks like a bigger 4xl than the last one because i'll be honest the march one we've got this cool if you haven't seen the video just a bit of a spoiler it's called deathstroke inspired t-shirt and i get my 4xl as standard only uh this one I put it on, it, it, 
it says 4XL, but it, it, it don't feel like it. They've used a real tight, soft, but tight material for that. But uh, hey-ho. So, for this box, four items. 17 quid, let's see. So, T-shirts, tenner. These can be picked up for anywhere from 5 to 15. So, I don't know. We'll go mid-ground. 750, 10 pounds, something like that. Uh... These are all of about a pound. I know that. Well, don't know, but that's all it's about. And uh, I, I don't know. This box, probably out of the four I've had so far, the shittest, definitely. I mean, the, the Batman t-shirt is awesome. I, I will give them that. I mean, the puzzle... It's getting a bit boring now, like, I mean, mix it up a bit, but okay. And then the medallions and some cheap, shitty magnets. I don't really care for, to be honest. But, uh, yeah. So, yeah, this this one, one of the weaker boxes, or the weakest box I've had so far this year. Not as shit as the 2017 ones I had, but not great. But that was everything I had beyond that one, folks. Let me know down below what you thought of this box. And I'm going to go and uh, probably gonna spend the next few days looking at other people's boxes. Because the other thing we need to know about Zavi recently is that with their Z boxes, uh, March specifically at this point, every single person that received the box, that I've seen evidence of anyway, received different items to everybody else. So it was like just a mix and match. Hopefully they'll get back on track with something a bit more um, consistent. But hey ho, see you on the next one folks, stay safe, have a good day, and of course, live the pop fanatic life, or in this case, mystery subscription life. I'll see you in a bit.